descended the stairs of paradise with all my brothers grasping roses by their sides, stepping through the halls and drowned at last in light. It was none other than the transcendent glow of paradise. Some fawns were lifted by the rapture and we were all surrounded by this encounter. I knew I was one step closer to his chamber. Those soldiers of beauty who danced down steps of gold like they were skating on heaven's tiles, ivory chalk, clap and clasp the reins of tearing war elephants beneath the thunderous skies of Elysium stormy clouds. Mud makes way to hoof and foot as satires claim the skies ancient and divine, and all the world was light. Freedom, pleasure, euphoria, the constraints of goodness cast their chains. Locks and cracked iron did not remain, left those burdens like morality's restraints, and sat all above the elements' command. Elysium Rex sat troubled by an adult countenance, and he sat upon a throne of roses, a Babylon before him of endless gardens, vines wrapped around ornaments of worship. And though the old king, he knew what once filled merchants' coffers with plenty to harvest, those vines began to dry, and clay did crack with time, eroded the castle walls with rust that breached paradise falls. The mind can rot like broken pots, and scepters melt into a trough filled with shells, and the body dry like sticks. And the dance of life hardened broken promises, with a picture frame of a lost queen beneath, and the king's private songbird nipped at his grey beard and hair, as he pervade his crumbling kingdom, like those tablets he once held so tight beneath that hardened grip of mind. Fragments hanging over gardens, over balconies, as he stared out of the window at all the beauty now fallen to shadows, fallen irises collected by the pond once plundered, and lavender swayed in the breeze of war they will not be seen. Beauty captured, catalogued and owned, laid before the throne. Only the finest, only the best. As I made my way to the castle, I climbed the walls and tore. Do you feel it, brothers, sisters? That is paradise, breathing in your bones, its petals blooming like our hearts in arrest. Can you feel it burrowing in your soul? It's like all of life is dancing in the air, the smallest sound, a melody in our ears. The bugs and birds fly in synchronicity, higher and higher. The wind may never stop, the green parade in the sky. And this was the first time the year had changed forever. And this was marked by a single falling feather. Its bronze reflection landed on a statue, dancing on marble inscribed. This life passes once before us and never again we shall meet. Beyond the garden and all its seas, sigs from figs and fruits bow to new, new beginnings from every part of paradise's soil, and my brothers bounding through its rooms like gardens of the soul. Draped across its steps were Elysium's daughters one and all. As I walked up to his chamber, each step it struck a chord, like climbing a harp to heaven. 
and he heard my footsteps on the floor. So it was you, after all. I clutched his hair, and with my blade removed his head from his shoulders. His body fell to the floor by my feet. From the corner of my eye there stood the seat, adorned in golden bone. Perishing petals in the heat fell by my feet. As I ascend my rightful throne, and there for the first time, I sat my hands upon the crown. Just then the queen appeared, shining like the sun. A new era had begun. <laughs> 